a little bit more to this story and you want to talk about a couple of wild companions and then you have a third person here who was involved who really wasn't having a good day. Now it started off as just another Sunday for Cascade man Gerald Ryder, a man who says he was drinking with his buddy at the time. But when he decided to go into town and try to show off some of his animals, that's when things got really interesting. Can you give Kiwi a kiss? Oh, you're okay. Not every day do you see a parrot and a zebra inside of a home. But in this Cascade house, it's commonplace. Is she sick in her bottle? On Sunday night, though, police say Kiwi's intoxicated dad, Gerald, got she and Izzy into a bit of trouble. I pulled ahead 10 feet, got out, and went to go walk to the other side with the parrot on my shoulder, and he pulled right up front, and he asked me for my license. I says, well, yeah, I got one, but why do I need a license? But the Dubuque Police Department has a different story. Jared was allegedly driving drunk at .148. That's when officers found him and his two pets. I've been doing this for 15 years and uh, I've never encountered a zebra. Jared was trying to bring his parrot and zebra into the doghouse lounge, a place known for allowing folks to bring in their pets. Did you find the parrot? Yeah, it's in the truck. I think it's a macaw. Scanner audio shows police dealing with the situation. Pull the zebra fit in the squad if we need to. Yeah. I'm really hot about it. I ain't been right for a day and a half. Back at home, Gerald's upset about a picture that's been released. One that shows Izzy and Kiwi locked in the car. But, but then get accused for abusing the pet you love. And I don't have any kids. My brother don't have any kids. Everything's our animals. Gerald says police are accusing him of animal cruelty. The family, though, says they never do such a thing. She runs the house when she's in here. She sleeps in here. So whether or not Gerald had one too many drinks is almost besides the point according to him. Well, it don't take me nothing. I only weigh 150. But was Gerald toast behind the wheel or not? Maybe the only ones who know that are Kiwi and Izzy. Should ask the zebra to comment on this one. All right, well, the uh, one question that still remains is who took the photo that shows Izzy and Kim, or Kiwi, in the car? Well, Gerald claims that police did. However, we asked that police today, and they deny that accusation. How about that, Jason Rochelle? Mm -hmm.